Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be showing you my makeup brush washing routine. So let's get into it. I'm also going to be washing my beauty blenders and my brushes are really due for cleaning. Like, ew. First step to my routine, I'm taking this brush cleaning pad I got it at the Dollarama and it has a, sil or a suction cup so you just want to make sure that the sink is dry and then you're going to stick it down and I use Dawn dish soap because it fights oils and dirt and I just find it works the best for my brushes now I'm just like grabbing all my big brushes I usually do my big brushes first and then I'll just wet it, um, put a little bit of soap on it, and then depending how dirty the brush is, I'll wash it two to three times. Once the brush has been washed two to three times, I rinse it out very thoroughly and then set my brushes out on a towel and I let them sit there like until they're dry because you don't want any mold or bacteria to form in the handles or in the bristles. Also, I usually bring them to my room after I'm done washing them all and just let them lay out to dry. Having them in the bathroom probably isn't a good idea because there's, like, bacteria floating around in the the air and it's just, like, if someone had a shower, it's just, like, moist in there and stuff like that. So, just something to think about. Um, now I'm just finishing washing up all of my brushes, like, all my face brushes. Next, I'm doing my fluffy blending brushes for eyeshadow, and it's just the exact same process. Also, I didn't add every brush getting washed, like, multiple times, because this video would be, like, 40 minutes long. So, if they're really dirty like this, like, I probably washed those brushes, like, twice, and then these ones, like, three times, because they're really gross. Also, a little step I forgot to mention at the beginning... I like to take the wet brushes and just wipe them off like this on the towel. This will just speed up your drying time a little bit. After I took a little break, I continued on with my concealer and small detail brushes. Next, taking my brow brushes 
and they're like eyeliner brushes kind of um Anastasia dip brow is very difficult to get off my brushes so I put some soap in the cup and then put wa hot water in there and then I just let them sit aside for a little while and now I'm going to give my beauty blenders a bath <laughs> First step I do while cleaning a beauty blender, I squeeze it and put it under the water and then let it go. This lets the water go into it and then when you squeeze it out, it's like cleaning it from the inside out. I also use the brush cleaning thing and it works really well to get all the surface foundation off of the beauty blender. Once my blender is all clean, I just set it aside to be rinsed out. Then I'm just going to wash the rest of my blenders and rinse them all out. And always make sure while washing your beauty blenders or your brushes, don't set them on the counter because there could be germs on the counter and what's the point in washing them if you're just going to set them on the dirty countertop. So, um, I'm now rinsing out my beauty blenders and I'm going to use the same technique as before. I'm just squeezing them, letting water into them and then squeezing them out. That will help get all the water and any excess soap out of them. Now I'm just washing my angled brushes after they have soaked for a while. Another good trick for eyebrow brushes that have products stuck to them or like eyeliner brushes with gel um, liner stuck to them. You can use coconut oil. I used to do this all the time and it will loosen up the product and it will make it much easier to clean your brushes. Also, some people may not know this, but you don't need like a specific brush cleaner to wash your makeup brushes. You could even just use bar soap or even just a nice hand soap to wash your brushes. So yeah, just keep that in mind. So that's my routine. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them down below. And have a fantastic rest of the day wherever you are. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!